Hey everybody, before you continue watching the video, make sure you give the channel a like and subscribe. Go and follow us on um, Instagram. Go and check out all the different social media um, scenarios. Make sure if you're enjoying the content, go there, like, subscribe, follow, so we can keep putting stuff out. If you've got any questions, leave a comment. All right, make a comment on either of our pages and we'll answer them as soon as we can. And jujitsu gives you that um, experiences with what happened, you know, like yeah. that we just take it. This is what I think I, I love get to, I love do things that I'm not good at right now to get the experience. Yeah. yeah. You know what I mean? And then yeah. try to do it again or try to uh, view what I have, the ideas, preconceived ideas I had. Like if you don't have experiences, if you don't put yourself in there, yeah. how can you get better? How can you actually know? what's gonna happen you can't but like people like to just armchair everything you know what i mean it's, yeah yeah it's easy to just have opinions on things that you repeating or regurgitating or whatever but like man have you i'll never forget this because i re-watched one of the podcasts that we did with octavio who's you know you know uh your instructor coach, and your yeah, coach and coaches, stuff like that yeah. and man like something that stuck with me is you're like you know you asked the question to him and you said you know, for people that want to improve or do this stuff, like what should they do? Or what, like if someone that wants to, you know, follow your footsteps as a coach or, you know, what, what should they do? And, and it's just such a simple thing, but it's like something that people never do, man. He said, right now in this tech, technological age, you have access to all the information on the planet. Whatever you want to learn about, go there and research and research and research and search for information and research and research and research and find information and that's it and then you're going to become informed on whatever you want to understand or know and then you can make good decisions on it and this is something that i just don't see people applying at all man like whether it's like people are scared because you're changing a little bit and evolving and growing and getting more confidence or um you know whatever like it's such a that that for me is just such an interesting kind of concept because we were talking about how like you were talking about how people change and your friends change and stuff like that and like a lot of the people that you know you leave behind or that leave or do their own things is man that they they're stuck in their in their way they don't want to research they don't want to evolve they don't want to take on more things or evolve as a person I want to be like this this is who I am it's like all right but I think the need brings that, that to a lot of people too you know they need to evolve they need to there is a need you know yeah I mean? some people have no need though yeah exactly yeah. then you get get stuck you know like you you have to have an the, the, the need helps so much you know like yeah. there is no other way you go you know you don't have nothing to lose has to be a must exactly like if it's just something you want to do you probably never do it it has to be a must it must take priority in your life to do whatever change you want to create yeah. whether it's losing weight whether it's you know, in, improving your financial situation yeah. or improving your relationship with your family, whatever. It has to be a must for the people involved or for you. Otherwise, it's just another thing. Oh, you know, I was tired this week. Oh, it's hard. Yeah. Oh, you know, my leg's a bit sore. I'm not going to do that. Oh, you know, but they were, I'll argue to them. They, I don't want to talk to them today. Whatever. You know what I'm saying? Like, you have to create these things as a must in whatever it is. Otherwise, man, it's just another thing. It's not important. Well, what are we in February now? I think the um, the New Year's resolutions, you know, I wonder Dying how many down. of those have Dying stopped. Down. You know, people are like, I'm going to do this for 10 weeks or I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do six months of this. And you think, what percentage? <laughs> I mean, it's not, yeah, it is what it is. That's very, that's very common. But yeah, you have to. It's easy to fall back into your routine, man. You know what yeah. I mean? Like, it's very easy because it's comfortable. Yeah. Because life's scary as hell, dude. Everything's so it's scary and, oh, I don't want to be uncomfortable for too long. I think we've been, like, as a, like a big group of people, like people in Western society in the world, we've been sold a propaganda of this, like, feel good, chasing feeling good all the time, chasing being happy all the time. You have to be happy. If you're unhappy, something's wrong with you. 
and I like I have a very different view on that and I've you know I've, I, I, I like to listen to a lot about psychology and humans st- and human evolution and, and a, a lot of the people that I've looked at that talk about that like happiness is a is like a momentary fleeting experience and it is necessary for a particular function but as a human being you you have a function to be unhappy and unsatisfied with things that's a that's a it's not a um it's not a problem with your software it's actually a feature make sense it's a feature of your software that's why we as a human race or a civilization have advanced so far that we have because you're unhappy with stuff so you go all right well better make myself happy again and then you go and do it you know what i'm saying yeah but i think now what people have done is kind of instead of again like i talked about this before but just like the way people have framed their views and the way they've kind of been molded to think and stuff like that is really in a negative way or not negative but in a way that's like unsustainable and doesn't lead to positive things in in life it's always about consuming products it's always about consuming momentary feelings i need to feel good i need to fulfill this lust i need to fulfill this whatever joy happiness whatever as opposed to like all right like what you did oh i lost in jujitsu and i feel bad and now i want to change my situation so now i'm going to work really hard and improve myself and my situation and then achieve my goal and feel really great because i did all the stuff that i was supposed to do and it worked yeah you know what i mean yeah. Being yeah, being stubborn helps, and like watching, maybe even watching uh, Rocky movies. Yeah, I'm yeah. Like, I'm like, okay, this is the beginning of the movie, <laughs> and then I. <laughs> <laughs> no, <laughs> but it's just like, yeah. Well, I just knew that I would be very disappointed in myself, and probably upset years later if I'd just gone, if I just quit then, and like, yeah. There's no making. I don't feel like there's any making it, but there's yeah. There's little wins that, that go. It was worth it. This is encouraging. I'm on. I'm on. A, I'm, a, I'm glad I stuck with something. Well, I'm glad I stuck with. And it. you know yeah. the funny. Thanks for watching the video, guys. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, make sure you give it a like, subscribe, and a follow. Check out all our different social media platforms. There's heaps of content coming out. There's different snippets and content on different on different platforms. So make sure you're on everything. And again, if it helped you out, recommend to somebody else, and hopefully it'll help them out too.